Ready, folks? It's time for the first annual 8 Byte Brian Christmas Countdown with guest stars Qbert, Michelangelo, Mr. T, Chewbacca, and of course, Creepy Santa. All right, hi everybody, and welcome back to 8 Byte Brian's Christmas Countdown. As this year, I'm going all the way back to Christmas Day, 1986. So, without any further ado, let's see what my favorite toy of that Christmas was back in 1986. All right, well, Mr. T, looks like you outdid yourself this year. Can't imagine what this is going to be. Pretty heavy. Ah, screw it, just rip it right open. What is this? Oh, man, check this out. Big tractor trailer, and it looks like we got robots on the side here. Now this is called the Star Tran by Ertl. This was a robot tractor trailer since Transformers and all that were all the rage back then. And I remember having a ton of fun with this as a kid. Wait a minute. Damn it, Creepy Santa, what do you want this time? I'm just trying to enjoy my Christmas. Ho ho ho, I've heard you've been very naughty, 8 by Brian. Hey, Creepy Santa, what you talking about, fool, with all that jibba jabber? This B.A. Barack is here, and I ain't about to have no fat, green eye, creepy looking Santa driving a crazy convertible coming in here trying to ruin Christmas for 8 by Brian. You better take that nonsense out of here before I give you a knuckle sandwich and send you back to the North Pole. You haven't seen the last of me, 8 by Brian. All right, now that that psychotic Santa's left, let's take a look at this cool tractor trailer toy made by Ertl in 1986. So this is the StarTran, which is supposed to be a robotic armored tractor trailer convoy, as you can see with the two big hulking robots on the side and the window overlooking the moon base with the futuristic city in the background. It has two big cargo doors in the back that open up that you can use to store all of your other action figures or their accessories in. And on the other side, of course, you have the decal again, which is really, really cool. And the smokestack, as well as other decals for laser guns and machine guns on the side. This truck also came with plastic laser guns and machine guns that mounted on the front, but they've broken off over time. And you can see it has a really cool future city scene on the front windshield. Alright guys, well, I hope you enjoyed checking out what I got for Christmas of 1986. And I'll see you back here next week. Hopefully Creepy Santa has learned his lesson this time. Hey guys, if you liked the video that you just watched, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below, and you can follow me at Facebook at King of Retro or Twitter at hashtag 8 Brian. See you next time.